Jim Bailey here um, with our uh, update uh, through the virus. It's a little bit, a little different of an update today. Um, as most of you are aware, um, and if you aren't aware, then you were somewhere else. Uh, we had a pretty wicked storm uh, kick through town on Wednesday night, causing uh, severe damage uh, throughout town. Uh, really um, unbelievable damage. The winds they're estimating were between 70 and 90 miles an hour and uh, caused a lot of damage like this, as you can see throughout town. We have, uh, as this is Thursday afternoon, we had a, a lot of neighborhoods still without power. Uh, PSENG is here uh, coordinating with our public works to get um, the wires and um, the electrical safe for tree removal, uh, get that process completed. Um, and, and hopefully get people restored. Uh, we were lucky that uh, we didn't really have any physical injuries at all. Uh, we're very, very happy with that. Uh, if you're out and about, um, well, we just I just was talking with neighbors over here, neighbors at the house that just, um, they just moved in, just moved in from Germany um, and moved in literally the middle of May. And um, this is the welcome they get coming back to the States in the middle of a uh, pandemic. Um, this, wonderful storm we had last night and of course the the George Floyd incident last week in which uh, has really set our nation and all of our families into uh, a bit of turmoil um, with respect to that I want to urge everyone on Friday um, afternoon and evening a group of high school students have organized um, a, a gathering at Haddon and Cuthbert uh, a, a walk that will be uh, begin roughly around Haddon and, and Collings proceed over to the high school uh, we urge you, if you are so inclined to please attend, um, to come join with them as we um, all try to remember this life, acknowledge um, some serious uh, racial uh, uh, issues that we have to deal with, some prejudices that, that are built into our system, and do what we can to uh, move forward and advance uh, the ball. We need to do it all together as a community. And um, I, I think this, this event is including our, our Collingswood Police Department um, and, our, and our young people, and it's probably the best way to get this all started. Um, I wanna give you a quick virus update. Uh, slowly, things are reopening. Uh, we are trying to work out a lot of issues with respect to our sports programs, our rec programs, trying to look and see if there's some way to make the pool of work um, this summer. It's really a difficult task. Uh, I can tell you that there are changes that we hope will be coming up. I think it's Father's Day, the weekend after this weekend that's coming up, uh, to get the farmer's market back to its location, a little bit wider of a layout, a little different of a scenario, but to move us out of the car uh, uh, and pre-order only uh, situation. So that's coming. Um, and um, that's kind of a run through of where things are. Um, I don't know if you can hear it in the distance, our crews are out. Uh, cutting up trees and trying to take care of things. That's the most urgent today. It's become the, the top priority. Um, it, unfortunately, it seems like every few days we have a new top priority. Um, that's the top priority today. Um, I wanna thank you um, for all of your help with one another, um, trying to keep everybody safe. Um, with respect to all this, when you see yellow tape out and about um, blocking areas off, we had a young family up under a transformer on Haddon Avenue that was hanging off of a pole going up to look at it. Uh, you, you can't go look at it. it is, this is not a, a, a tourist occasion. Uh, there's great danger here. A lot of these wires are still live. Um, once, they, w once we get these areas cleared, um, there's going to be plenty for everybody to take a look at. So please pay attention to, the, that, to that yellow tape. Um, when, with respect to the virus and everyone still struggling to make, um, to get back to normalcy, please take care of one another. Please pay attention to the people that uh, you ordinarily don't see. If you need any help, contact the borough. Calls, Collings with Cares, CollingsCares.org. You can contact us directly and we will do whatever we can to help make, make people um, safe. So um, take care of yourselves. Um, please don't hesitate to contact with anything that you need. We'll do all that we can to help out. Uh, be safe out there. Thanks.